You know, Pete Alonso playing for the Mets, 53 home runs. He should be making the round. If I broke that record, you know what I would want? That Herbie the Love Bug car with the number 53 on it. Todd, you are stuck in, like, in a... In a that's a, that's you almost are stuck. as famous a car as the Batmobile or... No, the, it the, is the not. Or is, any other car. Are you kidding me? If I put it right there with the most famous cars Whole in Whole question, movie most history. famous cars okay. in TV movie history. All right, go ahead, be Smokey and the Bandit, Batmobile. What other cars do you want to put in there, Todd? That's what I'm saying. There's not that many. That's why it's right there. With Dukes, of Hazzard. Dukes of Hazzard. Dukes of Hazzard. By the way, I love that he's getting more updated. It's as famous as any of the modern ones, like Dukes of Hazzard from 1983. <laughs> <laughs> Michael Vick, who joins us. Mike, thanks for joining us. You remember your first car? Do I remember that first? Do I remember my first car? Yeah. What was it? Uh, Nissan Stanza. Okay. Got it my freshman year in college. Yeah. How did that play with uh, the ladies with a Nissan Stanza? I mean, listen, listen, Dan, when you, when you got four wheels, I mean, and, <laughs> and somebody else don't, a minus four wheels, then, then you win it. <laughs> if you guys all had unlimited funds for one car purchase, would you go with that $100,000 Italian sports car? Oh, one? I'm not spending 100 k well, I'm spending a million. I always wanted the sports car, like, in metallic blue, where the doors open, you know, up in the air. Kind Lamborghini. Of the Lamborghini. That, that, I think that's awesome when the door opens up like that. Like a big <laughs> wing. It'd be so awesome if Todd pulled up to work <laughs> one day in a Lamborghini. <laughs> but I metallic can't, blue. Like I really can't imagine him getting in and out of the car in under 12 well, he minutes. Couldn't, he couldn't. If he got in, he couldn't There's get no out. There's no door <laughs> handles, so he's like, I, I can't get out. I can't get out. <laughs> There's stuff in here. <laughs> Would you rather make an error than knock your team out of the playoffs or lose the tip of your pinky finger? We should ask all-time AUAA GOAT Mario Miranda what he would do after he airballed in the semifinal game oh, to did, cost his did team. Did he shoot an airball in he, that game? He would give up the tip of his pinky finger. Do you finger. think so? I don't know. This will go down I would chop off his pinky to take that shot back. <laughs> we got a new game here. Is this person uh, a member of the Oakland A's, the Tampa Rays, or a U.S. Senator? <laughs> Matt Chapman. Matthew Chapman, I should say. I'm going to go uh, A's. A's third baseman. Well done. Yeah. <laughs> Angus King. Angus, Angus King. Angus King. Great name. Junior senator from... I'm going to go senator. Senator from the state of Maine. Yeah. Diane Feinstein. I'm going to go uh, raise. No, she is a senator from the state of California. <laughs> the crafty left-hander. I can't believe I got you on that one. You did. You got me on that one. Jeff in Indiana. Hi, Jeff. What do you have for me today? Well, uh, you guys are forgetting about the ultimate car chase. Okay. I I know the staff is maybe too young, but we're both the same age. Steve McQueen. 69 fastback. Okay. All right. Well, thank you, Jeff. Jeff working on those pauses where he had me on the edge of my seat. I'm all for pauses and silence on the radio, but... <laughs> Got to make sure they fit in with, you know, he, he, he kind of spaced them out for, uh, I don't know, no rhyme or <laughs> reason. <laughs> Tune in to the Dan Patrick Show, weekday mornings on Audience or the DP Show app.